New at nine, psychedelic mushrooms are currently illegal under federal law, but some lawmakers here in Arizona are proposing new legislation to spend millions of tax dollars on studying their potential benefits. A Valley Clinic opening next month plans to use psychedelics to treat several issues and says expanding into mushrooms could be a game changer. Fox 10 Stephanie Bennett is live after checking it out. Stephanie. Good evening, guys. Yeah, Day Trip Health over in Arcadia, they currently use ketamine, and they say the benefits of that have just been so great. Now, if this bill passes, they also want to expand into mushrooms so it can reach more people. House Bill 2486 has support from both Democrats and Republicans. Its goal is to allow research into the medical potential of psilocybin mushrooms for assisted therapy. The bill won't legalize them, but hopes to allow for $30 million in grants over three years for scientists to study the impacts that they have on 13 conditions, including PTSD, depression, anxiety, and long COVID symptoms. To groups that really could use it, like veterans, first responders, healthcare workers, and a number of other groups. Medical experts at Day Trip Health say if the bill passes, they'd love to help with the studies. We would love to do it. We'd love to be, you know, the first at the table for it. Day Trip Health is no stranger to using psychedelics for treatment. They're a ketamine assisted therapy clinic. Ketamine is, is entirely legal. It's a uh, scheduled drug, um, but under the supervision of a health care provider. And we hold space for them. We make sure they're doing it in a, in a safe place medically supervised. Ketamine was created in the 1960s in Belgium as an anesthesia medicine for animals. The FDA approved it for people in the 70s, but recent studies show it has powerful effects against fighting depression, PTSD, anxiety, and suicidal thoughts, just to name a few. I came to it because my daughter was going through cancer treatment, and so that was super traumatic, as it would be for any parent and I had terrible anxiety, I was always worried, and so I had heard a lot about psychedelic therapy, particularly ketamine, and I came in and had an experience, and it's the most profound reset. Every person is evaluated before their treatment, vitals are taken before and after each session, patients are given eye coverings and relaxing music to fully immerse themselves in the experience, and the medicine lasts 40 to 60 minutes. It's an inner journey, that's what's so cool about it. The turbocharged, light speed healing, what would, I think, take 20 years to accomplish with talk therapy, you can do it in, with psychedelic therapy in a matter of an hour. Yeah, and only two states have decriminalized mushrooms. That's Colorado and Oregon. Again, this bill would not work to decriminalize them or legalize them. Instead, it would just put funds towards studying them. Reporting live tonight, Stephanie Bennett, Fox 10 News.